Hi, so this is a quick overview about uh, debugging Holtec microcontrollers. As you can see, I have my e-link connected via this um, little ribbon cable to my development board and my prototyping board. My rotary encoder and seven segment display. So, um, to start debugging, um, go to your project menu and hit go, or you can just hit F5 key. After a short delay, and it automatically recompiles each time, uh, you'll see the board start to operate. So, everything appears to be working. The uh, rotary encoder works, the, uh, the decimal point for the digit selection works. And, yeah, everything's great. Um, so, the next step, if you want to investigate your code, is to let's let's set a breakpoint. So I'm going to hit the F9 key now, uh, or alternatively, you can click Insert Remove Breakpoint. As you can see on the left hand side, a little sort of stop icon appears, and then when you get to the when the code executes to that point, it will automatically stop. Um, at that point, you can go to your watch windows at the bottom. Uh, you can see I've already added some variables, but it's it's pretty easy to add them. So, if I wanted to add, um, find another variable. Uh, if I wanted to add a decimal point status, I would go to insert variable into watch window, and there you go. It's added it down the bottom. So, what does this tell us? It tells us that um, at the moment the ones column has a value of five, the tens column has a value of four, and the hundreds column has a value of two. And if we go to our RAM view at the side, um, if we look at the address, so you can see that the ones are at RAM address eighty-five. So if we follow this along. 85 has a value of 5. Now, if I, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this holding the phone at the same time, but if I hold the F5 button and rotate the rotary, rotate the rotary dial, so holding the F5 button allows the program to continue executing. Now I let go of it. And uh, it's not done it because I haven't got enough hands. Let's try again. So hold the F5 button and there we go. It's stopped on four. Hopefully this time you'll see that column eighty five, which is the the ones column, you see that now matches the value on the development board and it's highlighted it in red to tell us that the value has changed since it last um, updated and that's pretty much it